Hey everybody, I'm Louie with Jaffram, home of the Motorcycle Gear Experts. Today we're taking a closer look at the new Bell Bullet Motorcycle Riding Helmet, available here at Jaffram.com. The Bell Bullet is one of my favorite helmets to hit the streets this year. It's reminiscent of the original Bell Star from 1966, but with the safety and technology that you expect from a modern motorcycle helmet from Bell. This isn't a novel throwback, this is a truly premium full face helmet. The low profile shell is made of a lightweight fiber composite and comes in three different shell sizes with three different EPSs. The shape is intermediate oval to round. It's not exactly a perfect match for my long oval head, but the fit is accurate for the size chart. My 23 and a half inch head fits in this large. I would just prefer a little bit snugger fit on the sides of the crown of my head and on my cheeks for this to be a good choice for me on the highway. This helmet is available in only five colorways, but there's a multitude of shields available in both flat and bubble styles, so you're definitely gonna be able to dial in your look. Now the main attraction to this helmet for most is the vintage look for sure, but there's more to this helmet than just its rad appearance. Now the minimal chin bar has an obvious period appeal, but it also offers an excellent field of vision. One of the drawbacks of wearing most full face helmets on a cruiser or a naked bike with an upright seating position is that the chin bar can inhibit your view of the gauges and indicator lights unless you tilt your head forward, averting your eyes from the road. Now this bullet has a huge field of vision. You're getting a wide open view like you'd find on an open face helmet with the added facial protection of a chin bar in an epically cool looking package. There are a couple things to consider when looking at a vintage style full face like this one. The shape of the shell creates a very large opening around the chin area. This, combined with a lack of modern eye port gasket, can make these older style helmets pretty loud. I also noticed that this helmet performs best aerodynamically on bikes without windscreens. Again though, it's important to consider the focus of this helmet. Hermetically sealing off your head from the world around you isn't it. And honestly, I got a little wind on my face once, it wiped right off. <laughs> Let's take a closer look at a few of the features of this belt bullet. Now one of the features that really gives this helmet its personality is obviously the face shield. This helmet comes with a flat, clear shield out of the box, except for the TT version that comes with a clear bubble shield. Now there are a ton of options though when you start to look at getting that perfect look. There's four different finishes available in this flat shaped shield, and five more available in a really cool looking vintage bubble style shield. Now both styles of shields are available with either a brown or a black closure tab. Removing the shield, easy peasy. The shield isn't quick release. You'll need a coin or a screwdriver to remove it, but the process is really simple. The Magnafusion Shield Lock makes reinstalling the shield really easy because it holds the shield in place while you install the hardware. This helmet also looks awesome without any shield at all. Rock a pair of Wayfarers, a pair of Aviators, or even a pair of Dirt Goggles with this lid. You'll be styling and profiling. One of the features I really like on the bullet is the ventilation. So most retro-styled helmets, even the open-faced ones, don't have any vents at all. This bullet not only has them, they actually work. You can't close the mesh covered forehead vents, but the chin bar vent is adjustable on the inside of the chin bar, and there's even a Venturi spoiler on the back of the shell to extract the hot stuff. One place you can really see the value of this helmet is in the fit and finish of the liner. The material that comes in contact with your skin is highly absorbent micro suede, and the balance is all top grain leather. The gloss black, blue metal fake, and TT finished helmets come with brown interiors. The matte black and gloss white finished helmets come with black interiors. The leather neck curtain is fixed into the helmet. All the other padding though, completely removable. Now the cheek pads snap out in the usual way and the liner has a four snap setup. With the liner out, you can see the EPS liner and the large channel for the Venturi spoiler. The new Bell Bullet helmet is an excellent choice for the rider looking for a retro styled helmet with modern shell construction. Thanks for joining me for a closer look. To see more from Bell Helmets, subscribe to Jaffram on YouTube or click the link below to go to our website. Direct your questions to YouTube in the form of comments on any of our videos, or you can click the live chat icon on our site. You can also give us a call at 1-877-GO-HELMET, like us on Facebook for daily deals and rider news, and remember, when it comes to our customers, we'll ride the extra mile. I'm Louie, we'll see you next time.